gotta get a close up shot of that moose, right? Welcome home. Oh, Angela and Claire talking about whatever they're talking about. Fries. I'm thinking of You know what? That's pretty. That's pretty legal. I I agree with that definition. What are some slang words that are used by millennials? That I can think of like finna. Dinden. T. Sis. Sis. What else? Cruising. I feel like that's a 50s word. That's a bop. That's one. A banger. Banger, that's a good one. Dab. On them haters. <laughs> What's that one word? I don't know. I'm thinking of Sunday cool teas. I kind of noticed that once you said one of those din -din. words. Yeah, I think it was din, -din. <laughs> Actually, I, I, maybe it was the first word you said. I don't know. I'm just thinking about you like... You made him big mad. <laughs> Actually, big sad. Big sad. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> Mood, yeah. Yeah. Shout out to Bailey and his big sad so poster. Bad. I'm not a huge fan of slang words, so... I prefer British terms. But never guessed. Fries and biscuits. I've been watching way too much of the British Bake. What is I'm just gonna become the a British Bake Off. When you're yeah. Adult. I'm like on the last season. I'm so sad, but there's other shows, so I'm happy about that. There are other shows happening. No other British baking shows, like the Holiday One and the Beginners Version and the Master Class. So do you guys know the Property Brothers? Yeah. Yeah, they have a music career. Yeah, I saw that. They yes. It's so weird. The, the Property Brothers are like country singers. I have no idea. They're, they're yeah. it's so weird. It's strange. It's like hidden secrets. Last year we played Ghost and Grandpa, which is scary. It is scary, yeah. but it's kind of fun. Yeah. Okay, so you know what yeah. we're doing today? We're eating food. And you know what type of food it is? It's some warm, boxy food. So, the type of, so what we have is a thing called fresh baked pizza which is super nice it's um it's flavor number what's flavor number yeah look at that flavor number cheese no it's flavor number p thank you oh whatever that i means. think that's maybe pepperoni cheese and pepperoni mm. it doesn't look like pepperoni to me this is a here's the seatbelt this is different this is what is this Ooh. That's nice. I thought I that was my favorite feature. Is there does something happen over here? Yep. This is just like the folding seat. New car smell. Like a knockoff brand new car smell. Which I guess is kind of what it is. register could only identify as food. It took us literally like two minutes for this lady to like figure out what this was and then bring it up. Not because she didn't know what it was. No. Because the cash register didn't know what she it was. She actually accurately guessed what this price was so that's nice. Relatively small feet. Yeah I didn't think you had big feet. I can't fit in any of your shoes. Nikki what makes life is she guarding now? Uh, well, she's not on duty, but she makes Bailey do push-ups. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> How many? Uh, more than he says, and then he regrets it. More than he says? Yeah, he's like, oh, I'll do 20 push-ups. She, like, makes him do more than 20, and then he regrets ever asking to do push-ups. He asks her to make him do it? Yes. Can't hang around him anymore. He's not right in the head. <laughs> I 
what? Did you know that in, in 20 states, it's illegal to kill? <laughs> I mean, I would hope it would be. Too. I don't like, know why. Just the one that I like kind of backflipped into the sand with. Oh yeah. That's in pain. My hips are okay. Feels because the uneven ground, I'm like, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have anything to say to the documentary? Um, I don't have my work. Electric Boogaloo. Uh, it's, it, it's a documentary. <laughs> <laughs> Comment down below if you think I should have my own podcast. I think yes. I'll comment down below. Yeah. Revelations two by Amen Amen. You were just Hello and welcome to the Becca portion of this documentary. We are currently at the beach. Our friends Trevor, Ben. I don't want to zoom up on them because they're kind of like they're behind. But, they're in but the water. we're going to join them in a minute. Um, but we are also here to wrangle small children that will be arriving. ETA, IDK. I love children, but I'd rather go jump off the, the, the diving board. Yes. Yeah. Um, that's going to be fun. It's really warm outside. Um, let me see if I can check the weather. I may not be able to check it's not the that warm, but it's warm for us Michiganders. Yes, it's <laughs> warm for us here in Michigan. Michigan. Um, we'll be recording a podcast maybe today. Uh, definitely tomorrow. Um, this is probably not going to load for me. Um, but we're also possibly filming another Mystery Road show. And that's a tree. That is a tree. We have a lot of things planned for today. And I need to start picking out my camera more because I haven't been. Um, today's gonna be fun, real fun. You can recycle it. Well, we agreed that it was vegan because yeah. I just wanna do it for the camera. I wanna tell the camera that this is vegan. <laughs> we found out that Pam is vegan. And one container holds 746 servings. Mm -hmm. um, so this is good by May 3rd, 2020. So you better use all 746 servings by that date. Anything in the documentary? Uh, poop. New one and stuff, and I'm like, I know who you guys to check out my YouTube channel. What you do? Uh, it's Andrew Dances. I, mean, I, I just dance around the world. Uh, check it out on YouTube. Actually, that would be a really great idea. Like yeah. Twitter, LinkedIn, uh, Google Plus, Snapchat, MySpace. Uh, what are some other ones that I have? AOL Instant Messenger. Yeah, AOL Instant Messenger. Uh, Smoke Signal. That's just like literally a fire. Carrier pigeon. Carrier pigeon. Drone. Pony Express. No. You don't. You don't do Pony Express. No. Hey, how fast would it take me if I ran back to the bathroom from here? Yeah. What did we do? We just 
got some food. We both got wraps and chips. Um, Becca got a lot of veggies. I got meat, cheese, and ketchup. What type of chips did you get? None. Oh, I got glorious Doritos. So that's what we're doing. I'm probably gonna head over to the trade of some time and get some merch. And that's about all. Like, those are our people right there. Right there on that swan that you can't really see. Right there. Those are our people. Okay, perfect. I got a nice sleep. Good job. Did you get your food? I got my food. Yay! You can spit them. I mean, I should get the trash can, huh? So what is there got? a strategy to this? Oh, uh, this might be harder. Well, we probably would want to stick it, like your tongue would probably want to be on like this flat part, so you probably want to stick them in. Mom explaining how to stuff Pringles right. in your mouth. All right, let's see. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Huh? <laughs> so how do you have to get it all the way so you can like shut your mouth? Or? Boom. Ah, you scared me. Beautiful. Should we go find Abby? Yeah.